Pogo makes a map of the green. I call it the Doppler radar of, of moisture in the green or soil moisture, right? Well, and I think that our conditions are day in and day out better based on the information that we get from Pogo. We needed to improve the coverage of the irrigation system to eliminate the disease. There's no chemical or other mechanical controls of this. And so that if you're on the fence about getting the cloud service, it'll change everything that you that you do with your irrigation. Um, it's money well spent. It's probably the best, one of the best investments that we've made in the last year was upgrading. We all thought it was too expensive. Looking back, it's very affordable when you consider what you get for the, the money. And it gave them immediately, you know, just a visual analysis of the green and then really pinpoint where they need to go with, uh, you know, for hand water. So it's, uh, it's a great tool to be able to train staff. I didn't expect it to be so easy and user friendly. That's, okay. That's my main point. We flipped it on its head. And now we are micromanaging greens uh, a lot more fairer with the uh, Pogo. You know, when we first started using Pogo out here, pretty interesting we were always managing from sight everything was a look so it was a surface uh, whether it be color walking on it feeling it or um, and once we started using pogo we really changed that to 14 and we just bought two more today 16 and if there's budget for more we'll get more yeah, absolutely I think it's you know it's allowed me to manage my greens um, you know, the way I really want to manage it, it's giving me all the, you know, the EC and the moisture and the temperature, and it's allowed me to really make great correlations so I can manage my greens better. Um, I bought the Pogo as a brand new superintendent. I uh, bought the Pogo in July for my first year, and being a new superintendent, it's very tough to kind of get to know where your problem areas are on greens and, and kind of manage your greens. And, the purchase of the Pogo allowed me to quantify data and actually learn my greens quicker than I normally would have taken a superintendent coming into a, a new piece of property. It usually takes him a few years to kind of understand his well points and, and understand where trouble areas are. But with the Pogo, it allowed me to get some quantified data to help me learn my greens so I know where my trouble areas are before they become trouble. It's drying out. We can just exactly get the points that we want instead of loading a whole green. Uh, from the first day, I found that it's really, really useful for, for the green keepers because we spend a lot of hours walking through the golf course. And then you, because my eyes, or I can I see things different than the than the, my spray techs or irrigation guys, whatever, my assistant. And start then, building your data set, your data set, which is unique to you, you can start managing with that data. And what we found was really, really big is we started doing more preventative reactions, okay, as opposed to reactive reactions, okay? So we'd see data that said, um, this is what's gonna be happening to the turf, so let's do something to this so we don't have to fix it later because it's a four times less efficient to fix it after the fact, to react to it, to fix the turf after it's gone purple or after it's gone dormant or after it browns up than it is before. In two and a half minutes of green, if that, if that's, if if a pogo is what forces you to do your job and inspect every square inch of that green, so be it and it's not wasted time because it's giving you data that's saved on soil testing and stuff like that as you're able to monitor ECs and know what's correlated with an EC buildup or high moisture content that doesn't seem to move itself from an area. We it's the ideal, whether it's speed, firmness, um, there's there's the factors that we're trying to get that, that, are that ball roll, the great ball roll. And the data has allowed all of us to be on the same page all the time. I was introduced to Pogo. And I quite like it. It's, I think it's amazing. Let's talk it away. Our members know about the Pogo. And I've spoken to our members about the Pogo because they'll ask, how come we haven't had a problem with the, with the Greens in the last two years? I say it's the poker, we've got this pogo, and this is what it does, it enables us to understand. Okay, mira, because logo has GPS. Yeah. Mira, here in the hole, hole number three, next to this tree on the on your left, here is where, where you have to go. And then the guy suddenly goes and apply. Experience on any given day, we have a we have to we have one day to wow that person, you know. 
sure we have our members and they see it day in day out and they appreciate the consistency but with a resort guest we have one day to make this happen and I think um, if we aren't you know the old saying if your greens are good the hamburger tastes better in the clubhouse right <laughs> I think that's true cut out we were probably running four to five times a week before we were consistently using the pogo we're down to two so do the math there i personally just saw some efficiencies within pogo that um, was going to bring us to a point that everyone could look at the data and everyone could be on the same page that was huge for me i i think the proof is in the in in the pudding there I think um, it should be a staple part. It should be like a sore prep. Every golf club should have one. If I moved today to another golf club, the first thing that I would buy would be a pogo or two.